Well, good morning, folks. Howdy, howdy, howdy. Thanks for joining me on this edition of today's edition of Pet Peak. <music> Yes, we're going to have a little pet peek today, and today what I'm going to do is I am going to, um, I'm going to give Max and Hampton a bath. Now, Max, as you know, is my newly adopted, um, he's a dorky, and I just love him so much. That's what the, uh, that's what the groomer said. The groomer said that he is a dorky, which is a dachshund and a Yorkie mix. So he is just the greatest, sweetest, most lovable little pup you could ever have. Now he's not a puppy, he's full grown, but um, he needs a bath today. He's uh, been chewing and scratching and although I give him flea uh, medication and stuff, he just gets covered in fleas. We got a lot of fleas out here, I suppose in contrast to Arizona, which we didn't have any. So this is all new to me, this flea business. So um, he's going to get a bath, and Hampton's going to get a bath, and I'm going to put it on um, uh, time lapse so it doesn't take too long. You can see how, uh, how things go for us around here when it's bath day. He doesn't like his bath, but he doesn't fight me too much. But you'll see how he always wants to just be done with it. <laughs> <laughs> so there is Max. There is Max. See him chewing. See how scroungy he looks. It's been about 10 days since his bath. And um, I really should have given him a bath. Uh, I, yeah, I like to give him a bath every week, once a week. But um, it's been a while. It's been about 10 days. So let's see how he reacts. Hi, Max. Wait a minute. My camera went off. Okay, now I can see what I'm doing. Hi, Max. Max. Look at you. You ready for a bath? You want a bath, Max? You want a bath? You need a bath. You little scrounge. Yeah, look at that. The fleas are getting to you. We're gonna take care of that. And let me see, I will set it up right here. This is my bath table.
Hi, Max. You feel better now? Huh? Max? Max? Do you feel better now, Max? Do you feel better now, Max? Hampton, do you want a bath, Hampton? Huh? Max, do you feel better, boy? Do you feel better? You feel better? Stop chewing. Stop chewing. You don't need to chew. Stop. I'm going to put some stuff on you. Okay, so that's how Max gets a bath. And it generally takes me a good half an hour, if not 40 minutes, uh, to get all of those layers of, um, you know, shampoo, special shampoo on him and to rinse him thoroughly and then get the conditioner on. So I'm going to get him brushed up, let him dry, get him brushed up, and then we'll get a good picture of Max, nice and sparkly clean. Okay, so Max has had his bath. Now it's time for Hampton. The Hampton doesn't get quite the rigorous uh, bathing uh, routine that Max gets because Max, Max has, uh, I put um, special stuff on him for his skin because he's got some skin issues going on. I don't know if they'll ever go away or I'm just going to keep treating him. Now Hampton will get the flea, the tick, and also the... Um, He's going to get a, a special shampoo for poodles with curly hair and, and whatnot. And then he'll get um, the conditioner. So he'll only get sudsed up and lathered up three times compared to Max. So um, Hampton is uh, very, very used to bathing. So he does a little bit better than Max. and uh, But he's still, you know, he's not a fan. So, okay. Ready for your bath? <laughs> he looks excited, doesn't he? <laughs> <laughs> Hampton. <laughs> Did you get a bath? What a good boy. What a good boy. What a good boy. Now you need you guys need a bath treat. You need a bath treat. Oh boy. You want a bath treat? Look at you. You're still <laughs> Max, you got a bath? Everybody gets baths. So that's how I uh, bathe Hampton. And um, he's not quite as vigorous uh, treatment as Max because, well, Hampton doesn't have the... Um, Hampton doesn't have the skin issues that Max has. And I think that's why Max is continually scratching and biting. He's got... Uh, 
skin things going on, whether it be allergies or whether it be um, uh, fungus or or whatever it is. Um, I try and, I'm trying to take care of it. I put hot spot stuff on him, hot spot spray, which works really well. This stuff here. This stuff works pretty darn good, hot spot spray. And um, you couldn't see it, but he's got some um, skin, uh, it's a little raw. Uh, so I spray this on his raw spots and it really seems to help him um, as it, you know, it, may, it relieves the itching so he doesn't have to um, scratch quite as much. So uh, I'm gonna go get them a uh, bath treat. I always give them a treat after their bath. They get a treat for everything. Everything uh, comes with a treat around here. <laughs> so I'm going to go get them a bath treat and um, and let them have that. Okay, who wants their bath treat? You want a bath treat? Who got a bath? Who got a bath? Huh? Did you get a bath, Hampton? You want your treat, don't you? Max, you want a treat? Did you get a bath? Yes, Hampton got a bath. Max got a bath. I give them these soft and chewy um, milk bones. Milk bones soft and chewy because they're, um, they're just little guys. They can't chew. Uh, well, Hampton can't. Ham uh, Max can, he can chew pretty good because he's got all his teeth, but Hampton doesn't. Here, one more. There you go. Okay. So now what I'll do is um, after they're all dry, which Max is pretty much dry, I'll give them a good brushing and then they'll be set for another week. Thanks for watching and I hope you enjoyed this edition of Pet Peak. Yeah, Pet Peak. All right, have a wonderful day. Bye-bye, enjoy your pets and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.